video that I have for you today is um, inspired by a music video called No Lie by Drake and 2 Chains. Um, I was watching this video and I saw one of the girls in the video with uh, makeup like this with um, sort of like spots coming out of her eye. Um, so I got very inspired by it and I decided to make a video on it. A lot of people have been telling me in my dorm room that I look like I'm from Black Swan. Um, but call it whatever you want to call it. Um, I think this look is actually really good for a Halloween look. Um, something sexy and very dramatic if that's what you're looking for. So if you want to learn how to get this look, then please keep watching. Hi ladies, so I'm going to start off with my Naked 2 palette and I'm going to be using the blackest of the black color in this palette. And this color is called Blackout. I'm also going to be using a pigment called Black Oxidide. And I'm going to be using a really fluffy blending brush. And I'm basically going to be taking this black and I'm going to be blending this out into the crease. And then I'm going to start by blending it up. And then I'm going to also put it all over my lid as well. So as you can see, my makeup is actually already on. I'm not using any primer or anything like that. Um, I already have a natural eye on and everything. Listen, in all honesty, I didn't feel like taking all my makeup off and this look was perfect with just a little bit of mascara and the eyeliner already on and it was fine to just put it right over your natural makeup. So if you're looking to do this for Halloween and you already have natural makeup on then go right ahead and just put this all right over it. Going back into the Nika 2 palette, I'm going to be going to a color, um, a taupe color and I'm going to be taking a smaller fluffy brush and what I'm going to be doing with this taupe color is I'm going to be blending out the sides of the black to give it a more blended look. Once I've done that I'm going to take the color Foxy which is a light matte um, whitish yellow color and I'm going to be putting this under my brow. Then with BH Cosmetics Liquid Eyeliner, I'm going to be lining the underside of my eye. And I'm going to be, I'm also going to be lining the top as well just to connect the top and bottom and almost make sort of like an open, an open V into the middle of my eye. As you can see, I'm slowly starting the line from the bottom lash line and I'm just bringing it in. Once I'm satisfied with that, I'm going to darken up my lower lash line with the eyeliner. And I'm also going to darken up the top line as well. Then going back to the Naked palette, I'm going to take the color called Booty Call and a small brush like this. And I'm going to be dipping just a little bit in it and placing it between the two parts that I put eyeliner in. Then I'm going to be taking all of these jewels for my eye, and these jewels are from Michaels. I'm going to be using the medium sized one, and I'm going to be using all different sizes of the small ones as well. I'm going to be using a tweezer that I got from Revlon, and I'm just going to be sticking these all over my eye into almost like a fanning out motion. Once I've done that, I'm going to take another really small diamond jewel and I'm going to place that in the middle of my inner crease or inner eye, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> then I'm going to take some more black eyeshadow and I'm just going to be putting this on my big blending brush and patting this onto the inner part of the jewels that I fanned out and then basically blending out the eyeshadow with the fan. And this is going to give the fan a more like intense look with the jewels.
once I've done that, I'm going to be putting on my Sephora fake eyelashes. And these eyelashes, these eyelashes are called Showstopper. I'm just going to be putting some lash glue on this and I'm just going to be blowing on them a little bit and waiting for them to dry. Once they've dried and got a little sticky, I'm going to start putting my eyelashes on. And I like to put on my eyelashes from the outer corner to the middle to the inner corner. And the inner corner is the hardest, so I use a tweezer to get that on. And then use my fingers to put the eyelashes into place before they completely dry. Once I've done this, I'm going to be moving on to my blush. I'm not really putting any blush on. I'm just going to be doing a lot of highlight on my cheeks and on my nose. And then also, I'm going to conceal out my lips completely. And I'm going to be putting on brown lip liner on the outside corners of my eye. On my eye. The outside corners of my lips. And what I'm starting to do here is I'm going to be sort of trying out almost like a two-tone lip, a brown to neutral two-tone lip here. And I'm just going to rub my lips together a little bit. And then I'm going to take a nude lipstick from Lancome. And I'm just going to be using that lipstick to blend the brown lip liner into my lip. Then I'm going to be putting a little highlight in my cupid's bow. And then you are all finished with this look. Thank you ladies so, so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this look and I hope it inspires you for anything that you want to create for Halloween or beyond. And here is a picture of the whole look together. Thank you so much for watching ladies and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Mwah.